This is a clip from our Saturday sessions called Meditate, Reflect, and Connect, where people who support this channel through Patreon and the Being Human podcast are invited every Saturday where I lead us through a different meditation technique, and then we chat amongst ourselves and support each other in a compassionate, completely non-judgmental space. If that seems interesting to you, you can go to patreon.com slash Marie. And you can sign up there, and I, I hope I get to see you this Saturday. Enjoy the clip. I think we've all lived long enough. There's no one under like 20 here. So we have some experience in the room. We've all lived long enough where if someone tells me that, Scott, you're on the path, man. You're really on the path of life. You found your path. And I used to think the path was like this walking into sunset and this beautiful straight path and you can picture maybe in Arizona or something and it's just clear and straight and you're walking on it. But the more we live our lives and the more experiences we have, we kind of figure out that this life thing is more like a jungle, that the path is a jungle, that we have a little machete here and we're getting caught up in some vines and then we find a bit of a trail here and then we're in the storm sometimes and then we're all muddy but then the sun comes out and it's beautiful and there's no bugs sometimes there are mosquitoes sometimes there's not and then sometimes we find a place to rest for a little while in the jungle and make a nest and chill and then before you know it we're on our way again and we got to keep moving i find that that metaphor fits my life it's not easy but sure it is sometimes it's not difficult but sure it is sometimes and we figure out that life is a jungle and life is all contrast. Life is contrast. The beauty without the pain, what is that? So if we get to be with ourselves and kind of come to terms with the sobering reality, it's got to be sobering. It's got to be like, okay, I've fantasized so much about what life could be, what it should be, what it can be, what it was in fairy tales in Disney. But now what it actually really is, it's a sobering but refreshing start. So that's a bit about a bit about my recent journey, and I'm sure all of ours. I'm sure we can all relate to that. Hands up if we can relate. We've had to bring it, we've gotten caught in the vines, man. Things that are totally out of our control, like the weather. So in this meditation today, we'll kind of make peace with that. And we'll relax into that. So I have a little exercise for us to do today. Um, if you have a piece of paper or a pen, or you can just think about it right now, just a scale from 1 to 10, how the mood is right now. Things that are going on with your in your life right now, things that happen during the week. What's the state that you're in right now if you had to put a score on it? From 1 to 10, 10 being you're on top of the world, and if you were on top of the world, maybe you wouldn't be here. Or maybe you would. So are you a 10? Are you a 1? Are you a 6? Okay, keep that number in mind. And then write down or think about something that's kind of on your mind right now. Something that's been on your mind for a little while. Maybe it's a challenge. Maybe it's a worry. Something that you're trying to figure out. Hold that in your mind there. And just get a feel for what the sense is about that thought. What's going on in the body? What we're going to do is that score and that thought, we're going to come back to it after our meditation together and see if it's the exact same, see if it's shifted a little bit, see if it's worse, better, but we're not gonna judge it anyways, okay? There's not a goal to make it better or worse, we're just gonna see what it is at the end of this. So, you have the thought, you have your little score, and now we'll get comfortable, and we'll gently get into our bodies right now. Throughout the jungle of the week, my friends, this is the time 
where you found a nest. This is the nest in the jungle. We're resting right now, okay? There's no need to walk. There's no need to get anywhere. We're going to rest. And I'm just asking everyone to stay on mute, please, while we do this. So just come into the body. And in this jungle, picture yourself in the most restful place. What does your nest look like, your comfortable spot where you're resting? <laughs> 